The party started. Let's see who's coming in. What's your favorite dance song? Funny how time flies. My sister will be so jealous. Can you just give me a little kiss on the cheek? Oh, yeah. What cheek? This one? No problem. Rashida, I am here with Janet's nephews, 3T. Can you tell me your all-time favorite Janet Jackson album? Probably Rhythm Nation, but I like all her stuff. Are you excited? I'm very excited. I'm, I'm hearing a lot of it for the first time. It's Janet. When you were hitting the club scene and stuff, what was the best Janet song to dance to? Dun, 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 dun. Dun, 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 dun. Nasty. Nasty, Nasty girl. girl. <laughs> What's going on in that party, guys? Nothing. No. Actually, he just, came out, he just came out and gave me the deal, because I was... Yeah, we came, but, you know, it's been a while. Rebe came instead of Janice, so we, we, we got to go. <laughs> you know, we've been waiting for hours. Well, I'm going to see Rebe. I guess. What do you want to add? I just want, We're doing I just a remix want, of Centipede. I just want... <laughs> what was your motivation behind this album? Uh, I, I experienced a, a lot in the... This is the last album. I've gone through a lot of pain and a lot of questions that didn't start to sing, and, and only I had the answers to those questions. So there was a lot of self-examination, a lot of self-discovery. Um, I feel that it's taken me 31 years to, to create this album because of going into my childhood, into my teenage years, and, and looking at all those different areas, those different things, the reasons why I did some of the things that I did. Oh my God, you have grown so much. <laughs> I went to your graduation. I know. High school graduation, and look at you. Well, that's it, guys. It's over, but we'll be back next time, so watch for us. Bye. Claire Beauty Awards in the Big Apple, and a party for Janet Jackson's new album, The Velvet Rope, in L.A., and they were speaking out. You know, it's a give-and-take relationship. It's a relationship. There's give-and-take, and there are boundaries, you know, and that's the way it is.